A very good evening to you. Thank you for joining us. Welcome to Sports Tonight. This is the Friday night edition of the show. It's the last edition of Sports Tonight for this week. And we've made it a very special one for you, just to help you prepare for the weekend. And um, let me just quickly give you an outline of what we'll be doing on Sports Tonight today. Um, essentially, tonight we'll be talking to easily uh, maybe the most important uh, Nigerian when it comes to sports in uh, our beloved country, apart from Mr. President himself, um, is my guest on the show tonight. Um, I don't want to give out his name yet, but I'm sure you should have an idea of who I'm talking about. Um, the second half of this show, we'll be spending a lot of time to talk about what we usually do on Fridays, what we always talk about on Fridays, a preview of matches in the Globe Premier League, and of course, uh, plenty of chess. Tunde Ogunshi could just return from Ghana, and it was very good for Nigeria in Ghana in terms of what uh, our chess players were able to do. So Tunde Ogunshiku will be coming in later on to talk chess. Uh, Said Abbas is in the house. We'll take a look at um, uh, the, the Glow Premier League. We'll take a look at um, the Federation Cup for the women. We'll take a look at um, CAF Champions League, no Nigerian club. CAF Confederations Cup, no Nigerian club, but we will just touch up on all of, all of those things so that you can uh, be updated with what is going on around African football. Of course, before we end the show tonight, we will have to take you to Wimbledon and talk about the Grand Slam. We're down now to the business end. We know those who will be playing the finals for the women. We know those that will be playing the finals for the men. So we will touch up on that as well um, on the program uh, tonight. Our last shot on the show will be cricket. Austin has put together a very beautiful report on grassroots cricket. And that's how we will have to wrap up the show uh, tonight. But before I tell you who my guest is, let me just start off the show uh, tonight via, by way of um, feedback. You know, we've talked about how key feedback is on our shows. Without you, there is no need for us to be here. And that is why tonight we want you to ask questions on what you feel to be the way forward for sports in Nigeria. All right? Very, very key. You may not know how valuable your opinion, your reaction, your ideas could be until you send them out and those who matter. Pick them up, dust them up, improve on them, and then you see changes in our sport. So please take this feedback very seriously tonight and get ready to talk to us and interface with us on Facebook, on Twitter, all those handles showing on your screen. Please get ready to be a part of what we are doing on the program tonight. And we also need to inform you uh, about how you can watch us live. We are live on YouTube. That's on the website, www.channelstv.com, youtube.com slash channels web. All right? So you can follow us uh, live streaming, seamless. You can also watch us on your iPad, your iPhone, your Blackberry on m.channelstv.com. Uh, you're already aware of the possibilities, and it gets even better if you are able to download the channels app for Android, for iOS, for Windows, from their respective stores. What that does is that it helps you to carry channels with you on your palm, and you can follow everything, not just sports. You follow the flagship, the news, you follow entertainment, you follow health, you follow politics, everything right there with you. You can even put it in your pocket, carry channels with you wherever you go, all right? So that's what we want you uh, to also um, do uh, as you watch us. But don't forget, as you watch and contribute, just tell us where this is coming from, your thoughts, your opinion, where you're sending them from, so that we can also um, appreciate you um, a little more. All right? So please, that's very, very key uh, for us on the program tonight. Let me just quickly touch upon this one, because it is very, very key. We've been highlighting this since the beginning of the week. The Nigerian Football Federation have announced um, the termination, that's a long story, it's no longer breaking news. Termination of the conduct of former captain Stephen Keshi, and from all indications, is now done and dusted. That man on your screen, taking that picture with the NFF president, Amaju Pinik, is going to be the next coach of the Super Eagles, Sunday Ulisse. And the story is that early next week, like Tuesday, Ulisse will be flying in and he will be signing the dotted lines. Um, is, is already perusing his contract, is already crossing the T's, dotting the I's, uh, looking through, adjusting, 
whatever needs to be adjusted, and by Tuesday, it will officially come down and sign uh, those dotted lines and efficiently, effectively become the, the coach, I beg your pardon, of the Super Eagles of Nigeria. And guess what? He hits the ground running because that same day, after signing the contract with the Nigerian Football Federation, he goes into a meeting with the NFF Technical uh, and Development Committee. He goes into a meeting with the backroom staff, I mean the coaches of the Super Eagles, and immediately his program for Nigeria, Tanzania, September 5, will be perfected so that we can hit the ground running. So that's the story um, that we have to start off the show with tonight. Uh, we keep our fingers crossed and once again wish Sunday Ulisse the very best of luck. May he lead Nigeria to such heights that we've never been before. All right, so please get your thoughts in uh, on all of that. Now let me tell you who my special guest is on the program tonight. And it's uh, a privilege because I have not seen him live.